very good morning students so as in our last class uh, we uh, did about the poem bird talk we read the poem then we did its new words and the meanings also in our today's class we are going to do the workbook exercises that is the question answers and then uh, the remaining objectives okay so open your workbook and uh, you have to listen and then you have to write also along with me so uh, question number 1 is name the two words in the poem okay the two words in the poem are robin and jay the two words in the poem are robin and jay okay number 2 what are the birds thinking the birds are thinking about the people what are the birds thinking the birds are thinking about the people number 3 what do people not have the people don't have feathers what do people not have the people don't have feathers number 4 what do people not grow the answer is the people don't grow wings what do people not grow the people don't grow wings number 5 what do people not like the people don't like sitting on wires the people don't like sitting on wires number 6 what do the birds think of people okay what is the question what do the birds think of people the birds think that the people are very funny the birds think that the people are very funny number 7 in the poem what are the three things that people can't do now here we have to write about the three things that are mentioned in the poem that the people can't do so number 1 is people can't eat beetles second people can't grow wings and number third is people can't sit on wires okay once more we'll repeat number 1 is people can't eat beetles Number 2 people can't grow wings and number 3 people can't sit on wires. Okay students so now question number 2 on the next page write the correct options a b c or d in the box. Okay so here number 1 name the two birds in the poem. So uh, what are the name of the birds that is robin and jay. So option will be d. Okay number 2 where were the birds talking so birds were talking in the garden right so in the garden the option is b number 3 the birds were thinking about the way that is the way that people grow so option will be c people grow number 4 people don't like sitting on wires and things so option will be a number 5 people don't grow what the people don't grow wings that is option b number 6 beetles are what we learned in the meanings also right beetles are insects so option will be b number 7 which word in the poem rhymes with j which word in the poem rhymes with j now students we already learned about the rhyming words that is the ending sounds are similar right so j it goes with the word day see the option will be b j is day number 8 which word in the poem rhymes with no so it is a grow no grow number 9 which word in the poem rhymes with wings so it is option c that is things wings things number 10 which word in the poem rhymes with way so it is J that is D option way J So students now moving to question number 3 in your workbook what is the question C write about five sentences on birds using the words given in the box So here uh, children you can write your own sentences also see uh, how i have written first word we can use is nests so birds built nests on the trees second word we can use beak as they use their beaks for eating 
they use their beaks for eating then they make the chirping sounds okay the birds make chirping sounds so we have here use the word chirp number 4 that the word number 4 is fly okay so here we can make the sentence by writing some birds can fly very high in the sky so here fly and sky both the words we have used in the sentence some birds can fly very high in the sky and next is wings so the wings of birds enable them to fly the wings of birds enable them to fly okay means wo wings ki uh, through hi ud sakte hain okay children so here question number 4 in your workbook write two rhyming words okay now rhyming words also you can write your own also see number 1 is day so two words we are writing that is lay and way l a y lay and w a y way number 2 is thing so rhyming words will be blink b l i n k blink and wink w i n k number 3 funny so words can be bunny and sunny that is b u d l e n y bunny and s u d l e n y sunny number 4 is eat so the rhyming words can be heat and neat that is h e a t heat and n e a t neat number 5 ring so number 1 can be sing s i n g and second will be wing w i n g okay students so now next question number 5 write the names of the birds and their sounds okay here you have to write the name of the birds and their sound so first word given to us is owl so owl makes a sound of hoot owl makes hooting sound okay owl and sound uh, at the place of sound you will write hoot number 2 is sparrow sound of sparrow is chirp 3 is parrot and the sound will be screech parrot screeches okay then fourth one is duck okay everyone knows the sound of duck that is quack and then number 5 is hen hen the hen uh, the sound of hen is cluck and then last one is pigeon the pigeon the sound of pigeon will be coo okay pigeon coos okay students so here we finish the uh, workbook exercises of this poem that is the bird talk Okay so complete writing it everything in your workbook and learn it also